Hello, we are live. Okay, let me make sure it's working on Facebook. Um, happy Wednesday, happy June 1st. Oh my goodness, you guys. Super, super exciting things happening. I'm trying to figure out what screen is best. I'm going to do this. You'll just see me down at the bottom left corner. So as you guys are hopping on, drop it in the comments. I am live in my unit page. Um, so the Rage Unit, the Brave Unit, and the Untamed Unit. So make sure you drop in the comments so I can see who is on. Hey, Alexis. Hey, Samantha. Yay. Awesome. Okay. So if you are hopping on, make sure you tag your team members so that way they can watch this training, you guys. So um, I am going to talk a little bit about June promotions and what the companies rolled out, as well as things pertaining to my specific unit. So if you are in um alexis or leanna's unit there's probably some prizes on here that that don't pertain to you as far as like our finishers club so just see your director for um your finisher club prizes um but i know that they have some incredible things in store for you so hello everyone is hopping on yay awesome okay so we'll get started here in just a second when i give everyone the opportunity to get on and it's only 801 so we'll get started here in another minute or two so like i said if you're hopping on make sure you're commenting and tagging your team members so that way they get the alert that we are live um and that way they can participate in this training because you guys we have um some good training in store for you so while i'm doing while i'm waiting i need to pull something up really quickly so continue to um, tag your people, um, comment, just interact and all of that, okay? Because I got to pull up one more thing that I forgot to do earlier. So it'll take me like two seconds. And um, <laughs> I'm on my MacBook and it is slow as I'll get out. So that's fun. So hopefully this loads okay because I'm pulling this other tab up i had everything already ready to go um okay so make sure you guys are commenting tag your team members and we will get started so happy june 1st you guys if you are new to the mary Kay world just know that june is like the super bowl of mary Kay. okay so we call it june boom and we call it june boom for a reason because this is the final stretch of our seminar year okay so this is the grand finale this is um when your unit will be crossing over big audacious goals this is when you can make some magic and some miracles happen within your own personal business you guys june boom is so incredible so incredible um, and also, if you've been paying attention to your InTouch splash page today, so like the main page when you log into InTouch, you will see some some news, and we'll get to that in just a second. However, on this um, front screen, you'll see um, this is real life results of mine from last year. Okay, so um, literally, I was at this time I was on a mission um, with the army, and so my customer appreciation in June, I wasn't even home. I wasn't even home. And so with my customer appreciation last year, I actually sold over $3,000 in a single day, um, over 20 customers purchased. And um, so I had this, this is literally a post I had made in my customer group, thanking them and shouting them out for um, their support. And so you guys literally, I wasn't even, I wasn't even home and doing it all out to my full potential, but I wanted to share with you my results from last year. So you guys can see whenever you are truly putting in the work for your customer appreciation day, you will reap some great results. Now, mind you, my customer base, I've been building my customer base for um, over four years now. Okay. So, I mean, my customer base is probably larger than a brand new consultant day one, right? Because I've been building my customer base over the last few years, but only like 22 or 23 of my customers purchased for me that day. Okay. So that means that they were ordering pretty decent size amounts. And I have all my stats in like a, a spreadsheet, but I didn't want to bore you with that. But I just wanted to show you that literally this was this was the amount sold between 20 customers okay like come on 
come on. Like, are you kidding me? Um, so you guys have such a great opportunity to service your people and to take, um, take June by the reins and get after it. Okay. So we will get started. Let's go ahead and dive in. So June promos, if you've been on your Mary Kay in touch splash page, you already know that right now all the skincare sets are 60% off you guys. So what does that mean? That means that you get to purchase them at a smaller wholesale amount, meaning when you turn around and sell them for full retail price, you're making a larger profit, okay? Um, so, and with that, there's also the flexibility and the ability to, you know, offer fun specials for your customers this month. Now, I wouldn't like give my customers 60% off my skincare because you want to make a profit, right? But I just want to tell you guys that with 60% off skincare, number one, even if you turn around and sell it for full retail price, you're going to make a higher profit, right? But also it gives you flexibility to kind of do some fun deals with your customers this month, okay? Now, um, you'll also see on the right-hand side that there's a new Go For Gold gold medal challenge. So what does it mean to achieve a gold medal? So in the Mary Kay world, um, whenever you recruit five team members in a single month, you earn what is called a gold medal. It follows you throughout your entire career. You get published in the Applause Magazine. It is a big deal. It is a big deal. And so for this month, they've actually created a fun promotion to where those who complete a um, gold medal this month, they will receive an exclusive training with Gloria Mayfield Banks, okay? She was the number one national who recently retired. And so she is going to be giving a training um, in mid-July for those achievers, okay? Um, you'll also get a special shout out and welcome from her. Um, and you'll get on-stage recognition at seminar in Dallas, Texas for, for getting a gold medal, okay? So five team members this month. Think about five people in your life that you would love to do Mary Kay with, even if they wanted to come in for a personal use discount, or maybe they wanted to make a couple, you know, a couple hundred extra bucks this month, or maybe, you know, they just, they want to do something different right now. So think about those people, create your dream team, write it out, because right now this is such a great opportunity for you and for others to jump aboard the Mary Kay opportunity, right? Okay, so that's kind of the the big ones, right? So our power up joy for the month, the power up theme of the month is power up your bookings. So I know my unit specifically, we're going to be really focusing on bookings, meaning one-on-one um, -on -one facials, virtual parties, whether it be Facebook, Zoom, whatever, um, power up your bu bookings. So whenever you hit your 600 wholesale cumulatively for the month of June, you will receive these gorgeous earrings. And this is our NSD Jamie Taylor rocking those. And those are so fabulous. I'm really excited. I think those are so stunning. So stunning. So drop in the comments if you are excited to earn your power up jewelry for the month of June. Oh my goodness. This is the last month to earn this jewelry. Like, you know, every seminar year they come out with a different jewelry theme. And so this is the last one of the Powered by Pink series. That's crazy. So who is excited to earn their power up jewelry for the month? Because I am. And who else is earning theirs with me? Who else is earning theirs with me? We're going to be matching. It's going to be so great. So mark your calendars. Mark your calendars. Okay. So on the 2nd, which is tomorrow night at 9 p.m., our national sales director, Jamie, will be hosting our Verge Area Moving On Up Night. So these are a monthly um, Zoom. And basically, this is where we get um, recognition. Um, this is where she kind of puts out announcements for the month or for, you know, our goals as an area. And so mark your calendar, set your alarm in your phone so you don't miss it. That's tomorrow night at 9 p.m. Um, and on June 10th, that has been labeled our unit-wide customer appreciation day, which we will talk about that here in just a little bit. And then on the 15th, that is the end of our star quarter four. So if you need to go look and see how far away you are from star, you need to go do that. If you don't know where you're at, you need to go figure out where you're at because you guys with these, um, 
skincare set discounts with June Boom, there's no reason why you can't become a star. It doesn't matter if you have zero dollars in the system. I've seen women shut down star in a single day because they made up their mind that they were going to do it and they didn't back down from it. And so with the opportunity we have right now with it being June Boom and with those discounted skincare sets, we have a great opportunity to knock it out of the park, okay? So if you're already star consultant, drop it below, get excited. You can always level up because there are different levels. And if you aren't a star consultant right now, then girlfriend, we can get you there. We can get you there. We have 15 days to get you there. And that's plenty of time, plenty of time. Okay, so next, these are um, the finisher club prizes for my unit specifically. So if you're in the Rage unit, you've seen this flyer, you're very familiar with it, you received it in the mail. Um, and so these prizes are cumulative from May and June. So whatever you have in the system um, for May, guess what that carries over in June as well. So you can truly, truly build on that and claim all of them. Um, and so that's the prizes, just so you guys know. I mean, I'm, I'm like, I post about it all the time. I've sent you guys so many things. So what are you excited about? Which one brings you the good vibes? What are you stretching for? What are you most excited about when it comes to our Finisher Club prizes? Okay, and so with my unit, um, we're doing weekly challenges. And so right now we're in week two. And um, each, each task is associated with a different um, entry. Okay, so whenever you add a team member, you get five entries. And so what I'm giving away this week is a custom exclusive Rage Unit baseball cap. Super cute, super cute. Um, so last week I did the crew neck. This week we're doing the baseball cap. So cute for summer. So whenever you add a team member between now and Sunday at midnight, you get five entries. Okay. Whenever you have a facial, so you see a face or you have a Facebook party or you have a Zoom party or whatever it is, you're getting four entries towards that. When you set up a coaching call with me, you will get three entries, okay? Because right now I have my Calendly link set up to do coaching calls with you guys. And a coaching call is a one-on-one -on -one session where you and I can connect and talk about your goals for the month and come up with a game plan so that way I can best support you and we can help get you from point A to point B, okay? That's literally all that is. It's super fun. Um, whenever you have a $100 day, you'll get two entries. And for every 10 booking attempts you do, you'll get an entry. So let's say that today, today is Wednesday, you sit down and you make 20 booking attempts. Guess what? That's two entries. Okay? So you can do multiples of 10 booking attempts. It doesn't just have to be 10, but that's kind of the benchmark. Okay? So that challenge starts now, and it runs through Sunday at midnight. So excited. What do you guys think about those tasks? Doable? Challenging? What do you think? What do you think? We'll get started here and dive in to our training. Okay, you guys, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. The training on Customer Appreciation Day, right? Okay, so have you guys seen my post about the Facebook template? Have you seen it? Okay. Um, if not, I'm going to show you it here. And you need to go add yourself to it. That way you can utilize it. I literally took the time to create a mock Facebook group that literally has posts you can copy and paste in your customer group. Okay. So key things with this. The template is designed to cover a seven-day span of posts. Okay. So it's designed to start posting tomorrow or on Sorry, my dates are mix, mix, mixed up. So it's designed to start on Friday, which is the 3rd, and then it runs up until the 10th because that's our Customer Appreciation Day, right? And then you can um, obviously have freedom to do what you want. You don't have to literally be verbatim for each of those posts. You can do polls. You can do lives. I actually encourage you to mix it up a little bit because that's going to help with your Facebook algorithm by kind of mixing things up. Um, and then in there, you'll see sales posts like, hey, I'm offering X percent off today. Um, those are just ideas. It's not that you have to do that exact thing. But all in all, I want to encourage you to keep things simple. Keep it simple. OK, so let me share my screen that has. Um, how do I do it? 
I want to maybe stop and then I'll have to do it again. Okay, hang on. I'm going to show you my Facebook group that I was talking about. Okay. So if you are on Facebook, this is the Customer Appreciation Day template. So you're going to want to make sure you have access to this. Um, if you're in my unit page, I've posted the link several times. If you are in Leanna or Alexis's, they can, um, I don't know if I'm in that group. Well, I need so I can't post. So, um, in this group, you are not to, d don't like post anything in here. Um, you won't be able to because I've disabled all of that. This is simply just a template where you literally copy and paste from it, okay? So let me kind of walk you through everything. So if you see in the about, this literally tells you, hey, this is a template specifically designed for the week of June 3rd through the 10th. Um, and so don't like or comment anything because it will throw it out of order. And so I tell you, choose a giveaway, which we'll talk about here in a little bit. Um, and the sales here, just an idea, feel free to do what you want, keep things simple, okay? So you're going to want to scroll all the way down to the bottom, which will be, you know, obviously chronologically, that'll be your first starting point, okay? So again, this is set up to where you can start posting starting Friday. So did you guys know you can schedule posts on your Facebook group? Like, you don't have to post things in real time. You can schedule it to post at a certain day and time for you. That's my secret to success when it comes to running a customer group. It's seriously one of the best things you can do. Like I do that every single week. I schedule out my posts for the week. So you guys can literally start scheduling out your posts for your customer appreciation day. And we're going to get into like the nitty gritty details of it. But I wanted to take the time to walk you through what this template looks like. So this is kind of like my welcome post to you guys of like explaining things. Um, and then. This is some of those sale ideas. So for me, like this is the one I'm currently running with. Um, so I'm doing 20% off everything, 40% off for 10 items or more, 50% off with 20 items or more. So basically the more that they are purchasing, the bigger the discount. But as you scroll through here, there's even like different little graphics you can select. And if you need help with like a specific graphic that you're like, I am not seeing it here. Please let me know. And then there's some things from the past. I did this last year, so I did it based on time. So the earlier they shop, the more that they saved. You know, it's kind of whatever you want to do with it. Um, again, you can have some freedom and have some fun to make it what you want. And then this is, you know, literally tells you posting starts June 3rd. Because, again, I gave you seven full days of posts. So day one, post one, you're literally going to copy this over to your customer group select one of these images that are here because i gave you some examples pick one that you like or if you're really creative you can go to pinterest and find one you like even better pick one of these take your caption post in your customer group boom day one post one's done now here's your freebie friday this is that giveaway i was telling you about you can use this to uh create your giveaway so that's just kind of a blank canvas for you that you can work with and then i do this is a giveaway entry, okay? So this is how they can get entered in to win for your giveaway, okay? So literally, you guys, there's a mix of skincare and makeup products. And if you notice in these posts of products, you will see my face. You will see my face. Because why? Because whenever you show your face with the product, it is so much more powerful than seeing some random girl in a magazine, right? So it is so powerful when they can see that you are with the product so if you have pictures with the product i want to encourage you to use those if you don't this should be encouragement for you to get some okay take some photos with your products even if it's literally popping on a lip gloss and taking a picture like that great awesome that's beautiful okay now you'll also see in here scripts so i've got them pulled up here for ease this literally shows you how to invite um, what to say the day before, what to say the day of, literally everything you need to say. Okay. So that'll make it really, really nice when it comes to communicating. And then this last post that I made in here, these are product guides based on skin types and concerns. So if you have dry skin, buy these items. It gives them literally what to buy. 
This is awesome. Okay. And then there's even like bundles that they can do. If you have oily skin, here's some things I recommend. If you have sensitive skin, here's some things I recommend. You guys, it's literally amazing. Literally amazing. And all the prices are updated. So it has the latest information um, because, you know, we did have some price changes. So all that is updated. Um, you guys, literally this template is where you need to be. Okay. So hopefully that is helpful. That was my intent. And so that's where a lot of this information is going to come from. Um, but let me get back to my PowerPoint. Okay. So refer to the Facebook template. That is where everything's going to be. Okay. So now what you want to do is set the date. So I have decided for my customers and for our unit specifically, we're going to do it on June 10th. That's a Friday. Now, if you feel that Friday, June 10th just doesn't work for you, doesn't work for your customers, then you can obviously choose a different day. However, I would encourage you to consider paydays, you know, maybe, maybe not doing it on a Monday. You know, a Monday might not be ideal. In my experience over the last four years, I have found that Fridays are the best days to do an, a customer appreciation like this. So again, you have the, the freedom to pick your day, um, but I am running with June 10th and us as a unit will be running with June 10th. But if you feel like, hey, that just doesn't work for me, then pick a different day. I would just, again, encourage you, think about the day of the week, think about paydays, think about that, okay? Next, you're going to decide on the sales that you're going to offer. So what specials are you going to offer that day? So here are some ideas which I kind of showed you with the template. Uh, the earlier the shop, the more that they save. You can do a flat rate discount all day long. So maybe you want to just offer 20% off shopping all day long. Um, or maybe you're like, okay, you know, from 8 a.m. until noon, you can get 30% off or however you want to do is completely up to you. But another, um, what I'm running with this, this year is the more items that they purchase, the more that they save. So you guys kind of saw that with the graphic I have. And so let's talk about that giveaway because I know I've been receiving questions about what to give away, how to do it and all of that. Um, sorry, I thought I had another slide on this. Um, but in the past, um, I have actually done a couple of different things when it comes to giveaways. So um, you, again, you have the freedom and flexibility to do what you want to do, which is fabulous, right? Um, so one thing you can do is for each item that someone purchases, that can get them entries towards said giveaway, okay? Or maybe if they purchase... $50 or more, they get entered into the giveaway or whatever that looks like, okay? But some things that I have given away in the past is um, Mary Kay products. So, like, I have a basket of Mary Kay products. Like, a lot of times it's limited edition items. It's a mix of, like, skincare, makeup, body care. Valued, you know, you, you don't want to, like, go crazy with it. I typically keep it um, around 100 to 200 retail. Um, depending on how much I'm willing to, to give away, okay? Now, again, my customer base is a lot larger. So if you're like, oh, that I can't do that, then that's perfectly fine. You could even give away a Mary Kay gift card to shop with you. You could be like, okay, everyone that purchases getting entered in to win a $200 gift card to shop with me. Because we know $200 retail is actually only $100 wholesale for us. Okay, so, and for, for a skincare set for a giveaway, I probably wouldn't do a full skincare set for a giveaway. And here's why, because I truly want my people to buy the skincare set. Because if I say, oh, I'm giving away a skincare set, then that will probably deter them from purchasing the skincare set from me. Because they're like, oh, well, maybe I'll win that. And then maybe if I win it, that'll be meant to be. So I would personally do a different route, I would go a different route because I want them to purchase the skincare set and not like put all their eggs in one basket and hope that they win the skincare set in the giveaway. So that is probably my best advice. But yeah, splitting it up and being like, okay, I'm going to do the um, lifting serum from the repair set because it's like 
amazing. And from the Time Wash 3D set, I'm going to do the cleanser because it's my favorite. You know, you can do different things like that. That's perfectly fine. I just probably wouldn't say, I'm giving away an entire skincare set because it could deter people. And um, it just makes it a little bit more fun whenever you can have a little bit of mystery to it. And so... I've also done giveaways that aren't Mary Kay related. Um, things like Michael Kors handbags. Because um, I go to like, you know, Fort Knox and you can get tax-free stuff at the PX. And so I'll find like good deals there. Or even going to the outlets, I found good deals. Um, so that's another option. If you have like a handbag that maybe you were gifted at Christmas and you're like, I've never carried it. It literally has a tags on it. I don't want it. Then that's something you could do 100%. But if you're going to do Mary Kay products, you can literally just put a basket together. And I'll try to, like, post some images. I meant to, like, pull up some examples. But literally just have a bunch of different products in it. Now, obviously, that's going to require you to have some product on hand to, like, take a photo and, like, put it together. Um, but you can do that and just be like, you know, this is valued at X amount. And someone's going to receive this once I hit my sales goal for the day. Once I hit my item count goal for the day. So that's why, again, having a goal in mind is really, really important. So you want to focus on, are you going to have an item goal or like a dollar amount goal? Okay. Because you'll see in some of those images that says like a hundred, a hundred item day or 200 item day, or, Hey, my goals will sell a thousand dollars today and all of that. Okay. So have fun with the giveaway. It's going to be great. Whatever you decide, just be excited about it. It's going to be great. Don't break the bank. Like, don't break the bank, okay? It's fine. If you literally want to give away an Amazon gift card, then do that. You know, like, it doesn't have to be crazy, okay? It doesn't have to be crazy. But do something because they're going to be commenting and interacting with your stuff over the next week. And that's going to help your, your customer group grow and get more you know, engagement, and also is going to love on them a little bit, okay? So I, I base every giveaway on, you know, their comments, their interaction on my posts, and then also whenever they purchase from me, okay? So whenever they purchase from me on that day, they're getting extra entries towards that, and so I always figure out how I want to scale it. Like, if they spend over $50, they get five entries or whatever it may be. Um, so it's really, really up to you and you get to have some fun with it. But that's just kind of my two cents. And so if you guys have like specific questions, um, jot those down because at the end of this, I'm going to open it up for questions. So jot your questions down so I can get to them here in a little bit. Okay, so that's kind of the giveaway. Communication, communication, communication. This is like the biggest, the biggest thing, okay? I'm like, this is what sets you up very nicely for the week. It's so, it's, it's key. You know, they say communication is key in every relationship. It is key in every sale day, in every Pink Friday, in every customer appreciation day. Okay. So think about like some of your favorite retail stores, like Bath and Body Works, for example. I love that place. Okay. I'm, I'm addicted to their candles. And so they literally email me. They send me flyers in the mail. They'll text me, right? And multiple times on everything, right? Because they want to make sure that I know when their annual sales coming up, right? So do I ever get annoyed or, or like turned off by that? No, I'm always like, thank you for that reminder because I forgot. So communication is going to be key as you're preparing for your customer appreciation day. So literally in this image, this is a screenshot of a message I sent in Pink Friday, okay? So that's literally real life text message from me, okay? So um, that's literally an example. So texting your customers. If you don't have your customers' information, have them register on your website. Literally have them register on your website. You can even do a uh, giveaway this week and be like, hey, if you register on my website, you'll go in to win a product, whatever product, enter product here, okay? An eyeshadow, whatever. Have them register on your website so you have their email, you have their cell phone number, you have their mailing address, okay? You're going to need all that stuff. Now, you're going to use all platforms when it comes to communication. You're going to use all different communication methods, okay? You're going to text them. You're going to post in your Facebook group, obviously, because I've 
created those Facebook posts for you. You can send out an email and guess what you guys? I literally have an email draft that I'm going to share with you. Oh my gosh. Can you believe that? Can you believe that? Okay. Let me show you what my little email draft is because I know you're going to ask. This is, I literally send out emails. Okay. So here's an example of an email I've sent out in the past. Okay, this was for, this was last year, my customer appreciation day. So this is literally what I sent. Hey, exciting news. I'm having my annual sale on Friday. And I said my goal. And I said, um, hey, th this is how you order. This is the deals you're going to get. Here's my giveaway. When I reach $1,000 in my goal, one lucky customer will get their order for free. If you place an order of at least $50, your name will be entered into the drawing. For every $50 spent, you will have your name entered an additional time. So if they purchase $100, that's two entries. And so then I tell them how they can order again and just how grateful I am for their support. So I will literally share this Google Doc link with you so you can have that and tweak it to your own customer appreciation day okay and you're probably like oh my goodness sending out emails that's so much work uh yes and no yes and no because you know what i feel that it's worth it and it it is another way to communicate and to let your customers in on what's going on and how they can be a part of your goal because believe it or not they care about you and they care about your goals okay so Someone said, what do you do when you get no response from communication on your Facebook page? So that, that boils down to your algorithm, okay? So that back to the beginning of this training, I was saying, hey, don't just like post and hope that someone sees it. Like communicate with them, text them, um, email them just like we're doing now. And also switching up how you're posting. You can even do polls in your customer group. You can go live and talk. Um, you can do different things to help with that algorithm. And so that's the key is don't post and hope, like literally get out there, put yourself out there and like make it happen, make it happen. Okay. So I will share this email template with you as well. Um, I meant to put it in the template group, but I will put it in there. I'll put it in there. Okay. So let me go back to my slideshow. So communication is key. Communication is key. So um, text, email, Facebook group, you name it. Okay. Very, very important. So get prepared. So what do I mean by getting prepared? Make sure that you have sales tickets. These things. I was literally selling stuff today. Make sure you have these things. Sales tickets. Okay. That way you can write out people's orders. Um, if you don't have sales tickets from Mary Kay, you can probably go to Walmart and find you some sales tickets that just aren't Mary Kay brands, okay? Do what you need to do, but get organized. <laughs> get your paperwork organized, okay? I'm like, I can preach on that. Make sure you have packaging supplies. So, you know, for me, a lot of my customers, they live out of my state so i have to ship a lot of things so um if you need packaging supplies make sure you have that stuff ready to go make sure you have you know um the basics as far as that goes make sure you have your payment method set up so if you're going to be using square or paypal or um venmo or whatever payment method that um, you like to accept, make sure you have those set up and ready to go don't wait till the day of and be like oh my gosh i didn't set up my square like, girlfriend, do it now. So whenever sell day comes, you can send those invoices and get it taken care of. Recruit help if you need it. So um, this can look like your husband helping you package orders um, or sending out invoices. Maybe you have a, a teenage daughter that can help you or a sister or a neighbor or whomever that can come and help you that day to kind of keep things rolling because it's a Friday. So maybe you have to work that day. Um, but I, what I want to encourage you is to don't let it linger, you know, so like get things sent out quickly and timely. That way you can get their orders to them and that way you can get your payment. 
Um, start scheduling your posts now. So literally, you guys have access to the template group. So you can go ahead and start scheduling out your posts now. So you can schedule posts for Friday, literally today. And I'll show you how to schedule posts at the end of this. Someone please remind me because some people don't know that you can do that. And then lastly, get excited. Like, I hope that after this training, you are so pumped up and ready to go and that you feel equipped with the resources and tools to have an awesome customer appreciation day. Like, I hope that is what you get from this because I am excited for you guys. So, what questions do you guys have for me? Drop them in the comments and I will um, answer. I will answer. And then I'm going to show you guys how to schedule posts. Okay, so while you guys are figuring out your questions, I'm going to show you guys how to schedule posts really quickly. Okay. So this is just the customer group, or I mean the template group, okay? So let's say I'm going to make a post. Okay. If you go to this little calendar looking thing down here, it says schedule post. You can select your date. So our posts are going to start on the 3rd, and we're going to say it's going to start at 9 a.m. And then we hit schedule, and this post is scheduled, okay? I'm not going to really schedule that because everybody will be like, what the heck? Um, but that's how you schedule posts in your group. Super, super simple, you guys. Super simple. And it's such a time saver. I literally schedule my posts every week in my customer group because if I didn't, I would forget to post in there. So if you're someone who's been struggling with posting in your customer group, you keep forgetting, try scheduling it. Take a day every week and just sit on schedule them all out. It makes a difference. You guys are so welcome. You are so welcome. I'm so happy to help. Um, if you guys have questions, just take them to your director, and she would be more than happy to help assist you. Um, but I know that a lot of you guys are requesting to get added to the template group. So I will hop off here and accept all of you guys. That way you can go ahead and start working on this, okay? Um, thank you guys for being here. Um, if you have team members that weren't able to hop on tonight, this will be available for playback. So just encourage them to watch this because regardless of how long you've been in Mary Kay, I truly believe you can have a fun, um, and exciting customer appreciation day. And it just, it sets you up so nicely. And, um, I truly believe you don't have to give your products away for free to get good results. Okay. So don't feel like you have to give all the things away for free or give your discount to have success because you don't have to at all. Okay. So thank you guys. I will um, add you guys in now and um, have a great rest of your night. Thanks for being on. Bye.